Let's not beat around the bush. There are a lot of books out there that have vampires, werewolves, and a myriad other nether creatures. So why choose to read Changeling? Truth is, if it were not for the Borderstones Children's Book Prize, I probably wouldn't have chosen this book. I just didn't think it would be my thing. But I was really, really pleasantly surprised. It's a fantastic, fast-paced, highly enjoyable read. The story keeps moving without being weighed down by overlong descriptions or superfluous explanations. From the first chapter, the clear, vivid descriptions and exciting plot sucked me in and had me intrigued. It's great. There's no waiting around. We are plunged straight into the action. What had caused the utter devastation in Trey's bedroom? Who is the mysterious long-lost uncle? Can Trey trust him? What's the mysterious amulet he's given him? And what is the truth behind Trey's, the death of Trey's parents? With these questions ringing in my ears, I fell headlong into a page-turner of an adventure that sees Trey learning to control his werewolf tendencies, living in his vampire uncle Lucian's showcase of a glamorous, high-tech London Docklands home, his attempts at teenage normality as he goes shopping with Alexa, Lucian's beautiful sorceress daughter, her subsequent kidnap, and his journey to Europe to save her and face his nemesis. Can he save her? And will he survive? With its strong male and female characters, it is a book that should appeal to teenagers of both sexes. And because of its pacey writing, I feel it would be a good choice for any reluctant readers. <laughs>